Hey there, what's up? This is Paul Murphy. So in this video, I'm going to give you a full demo and tutorial, A to Z walkthrough of GrooveSell. And I'm actually going to show you how you can set up a shopping cart on, to use on any single website on the planet in under 10 minutes. That's my challenge anyway. We might go a bit over, but I'm going to try my best. So um, you can, and I'm actually going to set it up to take multiple payments. So for instance, if you're taking a payment for an online course, you might have one payment of 997, three payments of 397. So I'm actually going to set this up so that you can use this for any product you can take like free payments, you can take a full payment, you can take various types of payments. So we're going to set the timer in a sec, but the first thing you want to do if you want to go and set this up is head over to GrooveSell, you'll be able to see that it's completely free. There is a video here, you can watch, it's only five minutes long, and they explain why they're giving it away during the COVID-19 crisis, um, they're giving it away completely free, but it's lifetime access as well, and they're never going to charge you a single penny and they explain why here basically um they want to give back but obviously want to grow their company and they want to show you all this amazing software and uh, if you love the you know if you love the cart software which you can get for free and save yourself 99 or 199 dollars a month you might want to upgrade to some of these a bit later so it's a very clever clever business strategy um so they make that very clear that that's what they want to do but there's no hard sell if you never want to buy these products that's fine you can have this for free for life okay and save yourself like 600 dollars with thrive cart or 99 dollars a month with most of the other softwares that you get so here we go we're going to set the timer so once you've got that obviously you can sign up here get started you'll get it free at the moment as of recording this it's free okay and then you'll come into this dashboard so what we're going to do is this is the dashboard we are literally going to set we're going to have that all set up in under 10 minutes so here we go are we ready steady go so the first thing you want to do when you come in here let me close that one because otherwise i'll get confused and um, the first thing you want to do is go over to groove cell so we come over here and then we come up to funnels on the left hand side so I'm going to go fairly quickly through this because I'm challenging myself. But obviously, I don't want to like make it so that you can't understand or follow along. But obviously, you guys can pause and go back. So this is the one that I just showed you. So we're going to do a new product funnel. OK, and we're just going to call this test. OK, and we're going to call this test 10 minutes. So I know which one it is. And then I'm just going to give the description as the same. Okay, obviously you can name your product whatever you want. This is obviously internal name and description. So pretty straightforward, probably needs no explanation, right? Then what we're going to do is we're going to come in here and we're going to have to set it up, right? So the first thing we want to do is we want to, we've got our um, choice of front end or upsell product. So we're going to choose front end because obviously this is a main product. If we create an upsell later on, we can um, create another product and call it upsell. So we're going to do that. And then the next one we want to do is decide whether we want a one-time fee or installments. So the price point name I'm going to call full, okay? And the price description I'm going to call full. Um, in fact, I'm going to make it even better. I'm going to call it full payment. And I'm going to call that full payment, uh, if I can spell it. Right, uh, let's just copy that because <laughs> I can't. I can't work fast. And then we want a new price point, which we're going to call three pay. Or three payments. And we're going to do that again. Okay, and then we're going to do this one as installments. And we're just going to give this a um, interval uh, every month. Number of installments, three. And we're going to make this one 397. Three. $197, okay, and then, so we've now got uh, free payments, okay, and that one time is going to be 997 because we're going to do it as though we're selling a high ticket online course. So we've got 397, 997, one payment, free payment, done. So we can go save and next. Then we need to add our gateway, okay, so if you want to set up your gateway, you can do that here. You can apply for a merchant account with them. They actually have a their own merchant account, and it's pretty good. It's pretty good rates. Or you can add in your own payment gateway. So I've got Stripe and Test Stripe. Now I'm going to use Test Stripe for this one simply because I am going to. Oh no, I need to go to payment gateways and then go credit card and then add in Test Stripe because we're going to do a fake payment. Now, what you can do here, just to let you know, is you can have in lots of different gateways. So if you've got Stripe, PayPal, 
um, authorized.net, a few others. You can actually put this in. Now, th what this stands for is percentage. So if you wanted to mitigate it across different ones, say you've got a big launch coming up and you don't want 100,000 or $200,000 going straight into one account and then getting frozen, because quite often that happens, you can mitigate it across different gateways. Pretty cool, huh? So, um, but we want 100% on this. And then you, they've got a one called pay, PayPal mitigation as well coming up soon. So that's all we need to do for that. And then we go save and next. And then we're going to go contents. Now, for this, obviously, um, it's asking for a sales page because it wants to know where we're going to send the traffic from. And, what, and the reason it wants to know that is because it's going to give us a bit of code that we can go and put on this page so that it all tracks everything lovely. So obviously, we're going to put in a sales page. So wherever you're sending your traffic from, you just drop that in. So I've already got this one set up, so I'm just going to choose that one. And then you just drop that in there. Okay. And then um, let's try that again. Copy. Okay, and then the thank you page, we want our thank you page. So this is where we're gonna send them after they've made the payment. So let them know because, um, and then the thank you page URL is the same for both. And the sales page is the same for both. Okay, so we've got that, we've got that. Okay, so this should work. There we go. So at the moment, um, you can use their own checkout page, the one I showed you here like this. Okay, they are gonna have a pop-up on your own site. You'll be able to embed it on your own page and your own custom domain. And when they release all this, this is all gonna be completely free. Okay, so you can go through some of these as well. Like you can have cart abandonment. There's all sorts of like funky stuff you can do on this. Um, some of these are coming a bit later, but for now, we're just gonna go save and next. Okay, and then the, the order bump's not ready as of recording this, but that's coming very soon. So we're going to go save and next. Okay, and then we want to make sure that our thank you page is the same for both. Okay, because the fact is, is that this thank you page is the same. Like if we were accessing different products, we could obviously choose different pages. So it's pretty cool. Um, and obviously, if we wanted to put some tracking codes on these thank you pages or when we send people to them, we can do because we can obviously make sure that if we've got any of our own tracking, we know what's going on. But at the moment, we're just doing this. So we're gonna go save and next. Okay. And in terms of fulfillment, at the moment, we can have no access page. We could have a downloadable file or integrated membership. Again, this is all coming later on. But to be honest, we are gonna just send them to our own thank you page because we're taking the payment for something that's not related to Groove Sell at all. So we just put no access page. So we just make sure we do that the same. And then, but if we did want to, and we wanted to integrate it with anything else, then you would be able to do that up here. That's that done. And then the next one, we want um, to know whether we're gonna activate an affiliate program. Now, I'll just quickly show you this um, because you can. Okay, what you can actually do here is you can decide that anybody that sends traffic in here is gonna get 40%. And then maybe if they refer you to somebody else, you're gonna give them another 10% as a JV, right? So I'm actually gonna not do that for this because it's not it's not needed, but I just wanted to show you it so you can see. And you can also do that for the three payments as well. And we can do commission overrides for like our top affiliates and things like that. Okay, we can create custom landing pages as well. So here you can see we can add a custom landing page if we want to specifically for our affiliates and all sorts of information here. But for now, we're not actually gonna activate an affiliate program because we're just taking a payment. And then we go save and next. And there we have it. And what we would do is we would then copy this code and put it on our sales page. And, be, and by doing that, it in, you know it knows where all the traffic's coming from and everything's gonna be seamless and it'll be able to track all your affiliates as well. It's not essential for you to do this actually if you haven't got affiliates because technically speaking, we're just sending them to checkout. So that's it, we are now done. That is how quick and easy it is. So all we need to do is make it live. So I'll just, oh, hang on, we'll go back again. So what we need to do now is to make it live. So we're gonna to go to here, no. I've got to remember how to do this. Right, so we need to make this live. I just, uh, there it is, okay. So it's in, you can see here it's in draft mode. Now I was trying to go in and edit it from the wrong thing, so it was just sending me back in. So this has eaten into a bit of our time, but I'm still feeling confident. So all we need to do here is go and make it live so we're going to go make it live okay and then we're going to have to give it a name so we're going to call this testy 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 
testy. Okay, I'm just going to give it something because I'm going to delete it. So we're making funnel live. And now all we need to do, that's now live. We now need to manage the product. We go to that. We grab the cart and we just want to make sure we set the cart up. Now what we can do with this cart is we can do a single price checkout. So we can decide which uh, price point we want. Or we can have the price points, all of them on the checkout, which is what we've decided we're going to do. So um, you can have a two step, you can have two step where you take the details and then give them the payment details. But for this, because we're doing it all on one checkout, we're going to do one step, multiple price checkout, and then we're going to choose obviously which steps we want, but we're having multiple, so we're going to have them all. Generate link, and we ha now have a complete shopping cart, and the time is, look at that, nine minutes and 16 seconds with out um with with a mess up <laughs> and i'm just going to show you the actual checkout so you can see that that's exactly what we did and you'll see we now have test 10 minutes this is the product we just created and this is going to do and what we're going to do here i will pause it because i'm just going to fill this out i'm just going to fill out some fake details so that we can take a fake payment because this is actually a test stripe account and i'll show you that this will actually send us to the this will actually take the payment and I'll show you when the payment comes through as well in my email. It'll actually confirm on an email. So um, I'm just gonna pause this. Here we have Mr. Joe Bloggs from Joe Bloggs Company and his number is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. <laughs> and he lives in London and he's ready to make a payment. So we're gonna do a full payment here and we're gonna, we've put in our test stripe number and all we do is put a date in the future and this will go through. Uh, it's obviously not a real payment, but I want to show you in my email that this is actually going to confirm. If this confirms, if it denies, obviously it won't send me an email. So you can see this is connected to my Stripe um, and I've actually used a completely free payment gateway. Pretty cool, huh? So here we go. Complete purchase. That will now go to that thank you page. Once that's kind of decided whether the payment's accepted, the payment's been accepted. That has now gone to the payment page. And we're going to check our email okay so we're going to there we go you've made a sale and as you can see right here we have a payment from joe blogs of 997 so that's basically telling us that that is a successful payment obviously it's a fake one because it's a stripe a test stripe account but according to groove cell this is a successful payment because stripe has agreed it because stripe it knows it's a test account so that is how you can go and set up a shopping cart to use on your e-commerce websites, on your, like if you want to sell an online course, on your websites if you just want to sell some products, take some payments. You can do this for free, for life. All you need to do is go back over to this page here. If I can find it, I've lost it. So I'll put the link up on the screen. It's um, tripfunnels.com forward slash groove sell. Sign up right now and get a lifetime free account. They're never going to charge you a penny. Um, um, they will do a bit later on, they will be adding in costs, but because you're grandfathered in now, you'll never pay for any upgrades. So go and grab this and I'll see you guys on the next video.